hi, and welcome to Sesame Street. Oh, hi, how are you? I can't believe it. Where is she? What's that? I had no idea. Oh, I can't believe it. That's the last straw. Wait till I get my wee little paws on. Aha, it's you, it's you, it's you. Yes, it's me, it's me, it's me. So what? Baby Bear, what is wrong? Yeah, why is such a wee little bear so angry? Why am I so angry? I'll tell you why. I've had it up to here with you, Goldilocks. Me? What did I do? Don't play dumb with me, sister. You know what you did. You broke my wee little chair again. I did not. Oh, yes, you did. But Baby Bear, she says she didn't do it. Oh, yes, she did. The whole thing has Goldilocks written all over it. Remember the story, huh? Remember when she sat in my wee little chair and ate my bowl of just white porridge and then slept in my wee little bed? Yeah. yeah. Well, it happened again. My wee little bowl of porridge is all gone. My wee little bed is all winkly. And my wee little chair is broken to smithereens. And you did it. Yeah. And you know what? I never want to see you again. Baby bear. That's right. We are not friends. Wait a minute. And Listen when I to tell me. everyone what you did, you'll have no oh, friends I, on Sesame I, Street. I, do you I hear me? Do None. I didn't no do it, friends baby bear. for you. Hey, hey, hey. What's all the commotion? Oh, uh-huh. You see that? That is the broken chair. That is the proof. That is the evidence that proves that you broke it, Goldilocks. Mm -hmm. Hold it! Goldilocks didn't break your chair, son. I did. You did? You did? Oh, yeah. I accidentally broke your chair. It was the craziest thing. You see, I stubbed my toe on the table, knocked over your bowl of porridge, fell back onto your bed, bounced way up in the air, and then landed on your wee little chair here. <laughs> I... Uh oh. Oh no. What is going on here? Oh, do I feel terrible, Papa Bell? I made a huge mistake. Oh no. I thought Goldilocks broke my wee little chair, so I yelled at her. Oh yeah. Boy, Baby Bear really yelled at her. Oh, I feel terrible. Oh, what should I do? Well, you gotta make this right, son. Yeah, how, Papa? Yeah, how are you going to do that, Papa Bear? Well, you see, I, I broke this chair, and I'm going to get it fixed. And you, you broke Goldilocks' heart, and you have to fix that, too. You have to fix it by making her happy, son. Yeah, okay, I'll do it. Hey, can I help? I'm great at cheering people up. Yeah, yeah, of course you can. Let's go. Thanks, Papa. <laughs> You're welcome, son. <laughs> That's my boy. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, good luck, baby bear. There's a zoo in me. When I get mad, out comes a lion and gives a great roar. When I feel proud, I strut my stuff, just like a peacock. And I never have enough. And when I'm scared, I'm a tiny little rabbit who runs and hides. When I get hungry, I'm a real bear. Grr. <laughs> oh, there are days when skies are gray and everything goes wrong. When I start yelling, go away, and people say so long. When everything's in disarray, I'm right where. Must 
sing this song. I'm sad because I'm happy, and I'm happy because I'm mad, and I'm mad because it sounds sappy to be happy when you're sad. There are days when skies are gray and all the world looks yucky. When clouds and rain won't go away, the road I'm on turns mucky. My feet splash in the mud and hay. My toes get wet and gucky. Yes, everything just. Every day was like this. Me too, Uncle. Well, if wishes were garbage trucks, crouches would ride. So true! Yeah. So true! Let's just enjoy the moment. Adventures of Clever Bill. Clever Bill came upon two giants arguing over who was going to eat a big, juicy apple. Me, said the first giant. No, me, said the other giant. You ate a 70-pound cheese wheel this morning, but I'm still hungry, said the first giant. Why don't you divide the apple in two parts, said Clever Bill, and each eat half, <gasps> said the giants. How clever! Two girls were arguing over who was going to bounce a big rubber ball. Me, said the first girl. No, me, said the other girl. Why don't you bounce the ball to each other, said Clever Bill. That way you can both play with it. Hey, wow, that's smart, said the girls. And off they went. Two ogres were arguing over who would get into the sleeping bag full of mashed bananas. Me, said the first ogre. No, me, said the second ogre. You got to swim in the cabbage juice. Yeah, groaned Clever Bill and said, two out of three isn't bad. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, Goldilocks, we're glad we found you because Baby Bear here has something he wants to say to you. Well, uh, now might not be the best time. I can see that you're very busy, and I have no, to go. No, I have other fire. Ba baby bear, baby bear. Now remember what your papa bear said. Yeah, you're right, you're Bring right. It. Okay. <clears throat> <sighs> um, Goldilocks, I I'm sorry I jumped to conclusions uh, back there about my wee little chair. 
I know you're angry with me. And sad, too. And sad, too? Well, that's why we're here, Goldilocks, to cheer you up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Papa Bear said that I gotta make it white between you and me. Yeah, and I just wanted to apologize for, for not believing that you didn't break my wee little chow. Yeah, he, he's really sorry. Yeah, but that's not all. I'm gonna make you happy. Yeah, and Big Bird's gonna help. Mm hmm. Hmm. Um, help? <laughs> what should I do? Well, um, when I feel sad or mad sometimes, Snuffy and I sing the alphabet. That, that always cheers me up. The alphabet? Mm. Yeah, that's a great idea, Big Bird. Yeah. 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 Oh, hey, Goldilocks, do you want to sing the alphabet with us? Mm, well, I guess. Okay. Hit it. Goldilocks, huh? you don't look too happy. Uh, yeah, you're, you're, you're not happy. No, I'm not. It didn't work, so leave me alone and let me be mad. <gasps> and oh, what's with Goldilocks? Oh, she's, she's very angry. Yeah, yeah, and she's sad, too. And it's all my fault. What'd you do? I broke her heart. And I don't know how to fix it. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, Luis. Now, you fix things, right? Well, yeah, I'm just on my way to fix Baby Bear's chair. Okay, well then, <clears throat> how do you fix a broken heart? How do you fix it? Oh, you know, whenever Maria is mad or, or sad, I always give her flowers. That cheers her up. Flowers! That's a great idea! You are a genius! <laughs> okay, come on, baby bear. We'll go get some flowers. Follow me. Oh, bye! Here we go! This way. Oh, the wrong way. <laughs> Wait up! Two fish out in front. Oh, right hand back. Uppercut punch to the alphabet. Begin. A, A B, B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z turtle had a cotton tail and long ears and a tiny nose <laughs> and a rabbit's head and body and legs now what if the rabbit had the turtle's shell and the turtle's flippers <laughs> and a turtle's head? Now, what do you think would happen? Take you now to Kermit the Frog with another fast-breaking news story. Well, I don't know why they call it the tortoise and the hare. I mean, why don't they just call it the turtle and the rabbit? Hmm? Oh, oh. Hi, all. Kermit the Frog here to report on what is being billed as the race of the century, a rematch between the tortoise and the hare. Now, as you track fans will recall, the first time these two met, the hare was a heavy favorite. But the tortoise, using a strategy which he called slow but steady, 
won the race. And now these two competitors will meet again. In just a moment, uh, uh, wait a second, hold on. I think I think the hair, the hair is coming to the track. You know. Uh, let's see if we can get in a word with him. Who asked you? What do excuse you me, know? Excuse me, hair. Uh, Kermit the Frog of Sesame Street News, uh, could you give us a prediction of the outcome of today's race? Yeah, I'm going to win. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, why is that? What do you think? Because I'm fast. Wow. Fast, see? Mm. Yes, indeed. And, uh, and yet last time you lost the race. I took a nap, okay? Mm. This time I'm going to win. You know why? Uh, because I'm fast. Mm, yes, I think you mentioned that already. Uh, oh. Wait a second, listen, listen to that roar. I think here comes, here comes the tortoise. The tortoise, ladies and gentlemen. There and he is. Look at this guy. Mm. Pathetic. Pathetic. I'm fast, he's slow. I'm fast, he's slow. Fast, slow. Fast, slow. Excuse me. Uh huh. Oh, he's uh. giving up before he even stops. Uh, uh, well, ladies and gentlemen, it does seem to be true. The tortoise does seem to have left the track. Runners to the starting line! Excuse me. Uh, well, ladies and gentlemen, the race is about to begin, and there is no sign of the tortoise. <laughs> He's not even going to try. On your mark! That's no tortoise. He's a chicken. <laughs> Get set! Excuse me. That, folks, was fast. Oh, the winner! The tortoise, the tortoise is a winner hey, once again, ladies and gentlemen. He wasn't there. He wasn't there. He, he didn't yes, even... He was, uh, and he did. Hey, somebody look up under the rule book. Look under C for cheating. He, he didn't... I wasn't... They were... They, I, I, he could, I couldn't... They, I didn't... I wasn't there. Wait, wait, wait. Get away. Yo. Thunder. Sports fans, it is I, Coach Van Count, with one of the greatest basketball players in the whole world, Mr. David Robinson. I uh, like your outfit there, Coach. Oh, why, thank you, David. <laughs> now, today we will demonstrate and practice a very important part of basketball, the dribble. Now, is this as complicated as it sounds, David, this, this dribbling? No, no, not really. You just... Uh... Just bounce the ball. Oh. But it does take a lot of practice to get really, really good at it. Yay, that was wonderful. <laughs> that was fantastic. And, and how often do you practice this dribbling the basketballs? All the time. You know, when I was a little kid, I used to walk around with a basketball and dribble it whenever I could. My, and how many times can you dribble the basketball without stopping, that is? <laughs> well, lots, I guess. I I've never counted. <gasps> this would be the perfect time to find out. Ha-ha! <laughs> yes, ha-ha. <laughs> this is my coaching staff. Now, my coaching staff and I will count how many times you, David Robinson, can dribble the basketball without stopping? Wait a second. This could take a very, very long time. Oh, I certainly hope so. Okay, now, when we whistle, you start dribbling, and we will start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Uh, look, I, I just can't stand here all day and dribble this basketball. I've got things to do. 8, 29, 
32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 2000, 2001, 2002, 2003, 2004, 2005, 2006, 2007, 2008, 2009, 2010, 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014, 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026, 2027, 2028, 2029, 2020, 2021, 2022, 
Okay, here we go. Walking away from cookies. Mm. Huh? Want to see that again? Okay, here we go. Walking away. Oh, what are we doing? From cookies. Dum de dum de dum de dum de dum. Okay? You got that? You surprised? Okay, in that case, surprise talk is over. Um, um, um. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Goldilocks! Goldilocks! Oh, Goldilocks! Goldilocks, baby bear has something for you. Yeah, are you ready? Are you ready to get happy and forgive me? Depends. Well, we have the perfect thing to cheer you up. Right here, see? Flowers? Yeah. Uh, there's ten of them. Yeah, ten of them. See? Yeah. One, One two, two, three, three four, four, five. Hey, hey, there's more okay. Goldilocks. Yeah, six, six seven, seven, eight, eight nine, nine, ten. Ten of them. There we go. Ten flowers for you. Well, mm -hmm. I am. Uh, Louise says that flowers make Maria happy, yeah. so we got some to make you happy, too. That's right. Oh, well, A beautiful I... bouquet of ten flowers just for you, Goldilocks. But Here I, you go. I, what? <laughs> now, what do you have to say? Achoo! Achoo? Achoo? Achoo! I'm, I'm allergic to flowers. Achoo! Now I'm not only sad and mad, I'm also sneezing. Achoo! Oh, Gee, no. you know, I thought for sure that was going to work. Oh, yeah, me too. <laughs> now what are we going to do, huh? you're not feeling well. Here's one rose to cheer you up. Thank you. Hi, I heard you're not feeling well. Here are two daisies to cheer you up. Thank you. Hi, I heard you're not feeling well. Here's three tulips to cheer you up. Thanks. Hi, I heard you're not feeling well. Here's four chrysanthemums to cheer you up. Thank you. Hi, I heard you're not feeling well. Here are five posies to cheer you up. Thanks. What did your doctor say? He said... Uh, uh. <laughs> Flowers make me sneeze. One, two... One, two, three. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Hey, yeah, yeah, we gonna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, hi, hi. Yeah, yeah. You know what? Elmo and Zoe are going to show the number ten. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Okay, you go ahead first. Go ahead first, Zoe. Yeah, right, a ten. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna right write there. a ten. Yeah. <laughs> go ahead. Go ahead. Zoe. Here I go. Yeah. Uh, uh oh. I got a problem. What? 
Hi. I don't know how to write autumn. Huh? Zoe doesn't? No. I know how to make lines. I'm good at making lines. But I don't know how to, to, to write a ten. Oh, well. Oh, that's okay, Zoe. Elmo will do it. Yeah. Elmo will write a ten. Yeah, here we go. Uh-oh. What? Except, um, come to think of it, Elmo doesn't know how to write a ten either. You don't? No. Uh-oh. But Elmo's good at making circles. Elmo can make lots of circles. But no tens. Well, what we gonna do? Excuse me. Why don't you just cooperate? Cooperate? Yes, work together. So, Zoe, since you know how to make lines, yeah. make one going up and down. Okay, if you say so. Hmm. <laughs> How's that? Very nice. Yeah. Now, Elmo, oh, since you're good at making circles, yeah? make a circle next to the line. Hmm. Oh. You mean I like over here? Exactly. Okay. <laughs> and there you have it. Wow, that's great! Yeah, yeah, that's super! Yeah. No, that's ten. Yeah! Ten! <laughs> Ten, it's a ten. <laughs> ten. Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. This is my horse, Strawberry. I'm going to take him for a ride. First, I put on the blanket and I put on the saddle. I have to climb up on the fence and get his bridle and put it on him. Take strawberry out of the corral. A corral is where you keep your horses. I need my older brother to help me get up on strawberry. Then we're ready to ride. Strawberry is a very good horse. He knows I'm learning to ride and he doesn't go too fast. When we're all done, we ride back to the corral. When I finish riding, I put Strawberry back with the other horses. 
and I get some hay and some oaks for strawberry. Then all the horses start coming where the hay and the oaks are. It feels nice to take care of my horses. They like me, and I like them. This is my street. This is my building where I live, number six. This is my door of my building. And these are my steps in my building where I live. And this is my door to where I live, apartment six. And this is my room and my bed. Ouch! This is my little sister. All this stuff is hers, too. Oh, dear. I hope I can find someone to play with. I don't see anyone. Oh, dear. It makes me kind of sad and lonely to think I won't have anyone to play with. Somebody come and play. Somebody come and play today. Somebody come and smile the smiles and sing the songs. It won't take long. Somebody come and play today. Somebody come and play. Somebody come and play my way. Somebody come and rhyme the rhymes and laugh the laughs. It won't take time. Oh, somebody come and play today. Somebody come with me and see the pleasure in the wind. Somebody come before it gets too late to begin. Somebody come and play. Somebody come and play today. Somebody come and be my friend and watch the sun till it rains again. Oh, somebody come and play today. Somebody come and play. Somebody come and play today. Somebody come and smile the smiles and sing the songs. It won't take long. La 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 la. Somebody come with me and see the pleasure in the wind. Somebody come before it gets too late to begin. Somebody come and play. Somebody come and play today. Somebody come and be my friend and watch the sun till it rains again. Somebody come and play today. Oh, hi, Miles. You want to come over to my house and play? Do I? G yeah, I'll be right over. <laughs> hey, I'm not sad anymore. I've got someone to play with, and that makes me feel happy. Q. <laughs> <laughs> Quiet! Boto and Tabanga did all. But did you? Hey! Q! 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 Quiet! 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 Q. 
this here's a story about paper making and this little class that I've been taking. We make paper, but not out of trees. We use old rags and dungarees. How do we do it? You'll see. First we cut them into pieces that are kind of small. Then we put them in a beater that beats them all. Turns them into pulp, which is kind of like soup. Then we pour it into buckets and we stir up the goop. Sounds fun, right? Then we take a wooden frame and we dip it in the mix. And we shake out the water, that's how we get our kicks. Then we open up the frame and slap it on the tray. First I had a little trouble, but turned out okay. Not as easy as it looks. Then we stack it in a press. And we tighten the screws. This flattens the paper. And the water gets excused. We open up the press. Take our paper off the pile. And we stick it on the window. And we leave it there a while. Paper's drying now. The pink one's mine. We take our paper off the window once it's good and dry. This takes a little doing. Oh, and by the by, see the different colors, reds, yellows, and greens? Remember, these were rags once and old blue jeans. It's really kind of amazing. Well, now our paper-making day is done. Hope you liked it. We had fun. If you ever get the chance, you should give it a try. But now we got to go, so we're going to say goodbye. this boat. I mean, if you're going to talk about something that I love, then let's talk about this boat. Because no greater love hath any person for any boat than I have for this boat here. (laughs) Good morning, Ernest. Oh, good morning, Amanda. You know what I love? Oh, what do you love, Ernest? Amanda. Yes? I love... Yes? I love this boat. Oh. I really do really love this boat. Oh. Mm. Oh, well, I love this boat, too. You do? Oh, yes. I adore this boat. Oh. I am crazy about this boat. Oh, good. In fact, my cup runneth over with love for this boat. Mm. Oh, wow, yes. Oh. Oh, I love it. Oh, sir... Oh, sir. Yes. Do you know what we love? Oh, yes. I know. You do? do? I know. You love this boat. Yes. yes. And you love, love this boat. boat. Yes. You yes, both love do. this boat. Uh-huh. Yes, we do. Oh, you love this boat so much it's coming out of my ears. Yes. Oh. And you want to know something? What? Do you want to know something? What? I love this boat, too. Oh, you do? Uh, yes. Wow. Oh, oh, we all love this yes, boat. Hi, fish. Hey, you know what? I love this boat, too. Oh, oh hey, love hey everybody. Oh, everybody, you know what we love? Huh? We love this boat. Right. Oh, oh, I love this boat. boat.
And now, here he is, that happy wee little bear to sing the song that his papa bear used to sing to him when he was sad and angry. Here's baby bear to sing the smile dance laugh song. Ta-da! Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's so nice to be back here with all you unhappy people. But that'll change. Get ready for me to sing and for you to be happy. Yes. Hit it, maestro. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. It'll never happen again. I know you're sad and that you're mad that I was no friend. But here I am to make it right, just like Papa Bear told me. So listen up and join White in. We're gonna make you happy. We gotta take a look at your frown. Turn it upside down and smile, 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 smile. Then get up on your feet and move your body to that happy beat. And dance, 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 dance. Won't you smile and dance? Shine on through and laugh, 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 smile, dance, laugh. <laughs> oh, yeah! Woo! Oh. Like it works. Yeah, yeah. How do you feel, Goldilocks? <laughs> well, I'm not sad anymore. Oh, okay. right. Hallelujah. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm still mad. Still, still mad? mad? Yeah. You don't know how much I've been through because of you, baby bear. You really made my day miserable. And I'm not going to forget this anytime soon. This has been one of the most awful days of my life. Why bears smile, or how the bear got her grin. There once was a bear that sneezed and blew all her friends away in the breeze. Cover your nose! Cover your nose! She covered her toes. She sneezed again <laughs> and covered her chin. Cover your nose when you sneeze, they cried. She covered her knees. You see, she tried. But again, she sneezed, just as we feared. <laughs> and covered her ears. Holy Moses! Cover your noses! Cover your nose when you sneeze! Just then, <laughs> she sneezed again. <laughs> but knew what to do. She covered her nose. They gave her a rose. And that's how the bear got her grin.
quack, 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 Q. Quiet. Q. This is the letter Q. How'd you do that? Do what? How did you hang that funny-looking thing in the air like that? That's not a funny-looking thing. It looks like a funny-looking thing. Well, that's because you don't know what the letter Q looks like. I don't know what the letter Q looks like? That's a laugh. No, this is a laugh. <laughs> and I still say, you don't know what the letter Q looks like. I do so. It looks like a, well, it's sort of a, it's kind of, I mean, it's kind of a... Would you like a hint? Yeah. Well, it looks exactly like this. Oh, you mean this funny-looking thing hanging here? Yes, this is the letter Q. Now you're telling me this is the letter Q. Yes, 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 it's the letter Q, Q, Q. Oh. It's used all the time. It begins such words as quick, quiet, quarrel, quit. It's the letter Q. Do you hear? Perfectly. Now, are there any questions? Yes. How'd you do that? Do what? Hang that funny-looking thing in the air like that. That's not a funny-looking thing. You're a funny-looking thing. One of these things is not like the others. One of these things just doesn't belong. Can you tell which thing is not like the others by the time I finish my song? like this before. Being accused of something I didn't even do. I mean, this is unbelievable. Oh, it's more I'm than a... any little girl could oh. take. Hey, everyone! I got some good news! The chair's fixed. Well, the chair might be fixed, all right, but Goldilocks' heart isn't. She's still mad. But what about the song? Oh, the song stopped her sadness, but she's still mad at me. I don't know what to do. Do you want to know what would stop me from being mad at you? Yes. yes. Letting me sit in your wee little chair would make me totally happy. I would feel great just to sit down and relax in a comfy chair. That's it? Then you won't be mad at me anymore? Yep. Well, then, let's do it quickly. Yeah, let's yes. put it down. Here. All right. Oh, Goldilocks, would you care to sit down in my wee little chair? Yes. Thank you. Let me dust it off for you. All right. There you go. I would be delighted. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so how do you feel? Well, I feel great. I feel happy. Totally happy? Really? Not sad or mad? Nope. I feel totally happy. <sighs> this is wonderful. Oh, it's about time. But, <sighs> uh, Baby Bear, hmm? you know what else would make me happy right now? What? A nice bowl of porridge. Oh, no, you don't. What? She had a tough day, baby bear. Go get her some porridge. It's the least you could do. Uh, all right, all right. Boy, chewing up is hard work. Well, Sesame Street was brought to you today by the letter Q and the number 10. Sesame Street is a production of the Children's Television Workshop. And don't forget the milk and toast and the newspapers. Oh, my slippers, baby bear. Hey, hey, hey. Don't push it, lady. <sighs>
Sesame Street is a production of the Children's Television Workshop. Coming soon on Sesame Street. Elmo loves weightlifting. <laughs> oh, hi, everybody. Down, Gordon. Up, Gordon. <laughs> yeah. Down, Gordon. Wow. <laughs> Up, Gordon. for Sesame Street is provided in part by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting and by public television stations and their contributors. <laughs>